Hello everyone, welcome to Food Review UK and a slightly different kind of video. We are doing a shopping vlog today uh, but we're doing it from the range which is primarily a not food place. Now we will obviously look at the food um, but due to some recent changes on the channel which we're experimenting a little bit more. Like I say, we will still look at the food and we'll still focus on the food but I'll give you a peek at everything else that's in here as well. So there's a brand new store, The Range and Iceland at Aylesbury. Let's go in. Oh look who we've just bumped into, also just came at the exact same time. It's brilliant. Brilliant, this is going to be an exciting vlog I think. <laughs> Furry teapot, that's weird. Green. Honey rabbits. Easter references. Barking up the wrong tree. What? What, it's like if it wasn't here, then they wouldn't want you to do it. It's not quite worked, is it? Biology. Oh yeah, that's good, yeah. Put ice in it, yeah. Nice pearlescent or iridescent flamingo. That is a watermelon cushion. Nice little ice cream, money bank. Pretty good. Claire, what do you think about this? Oh, no. Got Love Hearts candles, strawberry, vanilla and cherry. There is three flavours that you will not find in Love Hearts themselves, which is pretty weird. Smells like cardboard, decent. And lime and lemon wax melt chubba chubs kit. What a load of shit. Maverick baking alert, unicorn reference. Some paths are destined to cross. Ah. Oh. Claire going away has a marvel from there. <laughs> oh, great. Good humour. She has actually walked off though, so that's bad. But uh, yeah, marvel. Marvel reference. Fair play, this actually seems like a pretty interesting product. It's like a um, like a, a mirror that you can adjust, but also it's got a lock on it. And you can put all your... Um, well, that's earrings, isn't it? Uh, keys, probably earrings, keys, and then is that like snacks, like your Twinkies and whatnot? Good though. You are one in a melon. So what's that? Are you saying someone's a melon seed? You're a melon seed. I don't, I don't understand that. We make a great pair. I understand that. That's obviously a play on the word pair, but I don't. You are one in a melon. You're a melon seed. How would you feel if I called you a melon seed, Claire? Would you be offended or, or would you? You'd be, you wouldn't be offended? No, just a bit weird. Just a bit weird, yeah, exactly. It's just a bit weird. Unique filming opportunities. <laughs> huh? What is wrong with you? It's a wet one, wasn't it? Absolutely loving the rainbow card. Decent. I used to quite. I think I used to get a few of these when I was younger. I definitely used to get the glow in the dark one. Um, I used to be into like obviously arts and crafts and sculpture. I don't think I ever made anything actually good, but and I've always loved. Uh, I think that's glow in the dark, isn't it? I can't can't actually see where it says what one it is. Oh, they do glittery one. Wow. I think this stuff's quite expensive actually. It's a good yeah, two seventy five. So if you want to get into this, it is you know quite serious. This thing's a really nice bit of kit. It's like an outdoor bar. So it's just like in a mar marquee. Um, yeah, it's really nice. It's got seats there, just like chilling out. Oh, 300 quid bar gazebo. It's a nice bit of kit though, isn't it? Like hanging glasses. Decent, that is. This is a unique situation, guys. We can take a look down onto Iceland. That is the Iceland that is in the middle of the range. That is mental. Hey. 
Uh, hey. Hey. Hey, reference. The maxi pack. Right, we are now in the food section. Uh, this is Ison's own chocolate, one pound, decent. Uh, what are we looking for, Claire? Do we want anything in particular? Mediterranean sea salt, that's weird. It's a weird flavour. Frisps, one pound. Pork scratchings. The Arsky's factory, uh, I believe, is in Aylesbury. Certainly used to be. Huh? Ask what? Whatever. Askies, askies. What do you think it is, guys? No, I'm sure that. Well, honey and almond granola. The Alpen bars, supposed to be pretty good. I've actually got some of the cherry bakewell ones at home. Hopefully, uh, they'll be pretty good. Um, is there anything of interest here? Caramel blue ribbon. I'm not sure if they're new or not. Double chock cookies. Uh, four pack of instant noodles for a pound. That's pretty good. Maggie's a pretty good brand, isn't it? Uh, they have got a limited selection of them, which I like. Classic packaging on Thai food. Oval team. Uh, all sort of meh, corned beef. Um, Ice and bonus card not accepted in this store. That's interesting. <gasps> oh! They've got double choc chip loof. Loof, brilliant, I just said loof. Oh my oh, god. No, 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 I want single choc chip loaf. Oh, oh my that? god. Yeah, 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 because I, I crave it, Claire. Oh. I crave it, so I can't just get a random thing. Basically, Claire and I have been looking for a chocolate chip loaf. So, seemingly all day, they didn't have them in Aldi, they didn't but have them in Tesco. Like, in one plate, no, two plates. Yeah, three, well, this is the third place. We're going to look in m and in a minute. Hopefully we'll have them in m and I'm not actually expecting them to, but oh my god. To be honest, I didn't think they'd have any. The fact that they've got a, a um, double chocolate, but I, I don't crave it. So it'll be, it'll be a waste. Yeah, I think these are not that new. A couple years old. But an interesting product nevertheless, Claire. Well done. I wonder if the... Um, I wonder if the Iceland curry sauces are any good. I don't expect that they are. What's this got in it? Mm, nah. Well, they've increased their. Yeah, no chick, no porkies. Do you, do you like having a no porky, Claire? No chick strips. Versatile meat free strips of chunks of chick fillets. Wow, this is crazy. Noble Asian burgers. Oh, they've still got the Pakora chicken strips. Those are really good. Uh, I've actually had these recommended, though, the hot and spicy chicken breast. So I'm going to get some of them. <laughs> I nearly hit Claire there. Uh, I'm gonna get some of these hot and spicy chicken breasts. Yeah, you can. No, I can't. Yeah, you can. They're nice. They're supposed to be really good. You bite everything that I can't eat. No, 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 no. They're supposed to be really good. Uh, what about barbecue chicken breasts then? Do you want to get a barbecue chicken breasts? Where are they? But these actually look amazing though. Let's get some of these for me, oh, and then you can get. Do no, they're probably they're probably not spicy at all. We also want to get the um, the hash brown sticks when we see them. So we are right in the in the guts. Yeah, here we go. What about chicken nuggets? Kiev. Sorry. Where the potatoes are, not where the chicken. Wow! Listen to how rude she's being. Um, yeah, pizzas decent, good. Oh no, they're not gone. They've got normal hash browns. <clears throat> what do the labels say? Wedges, blah blah blah. No, they don't have them. Nightmare. Curly fries, French fries. Fine. Good. Birds eye veggie fingers, that's weird. Oh, they need a restock. Mm, ready cooked donut kebab, mate. That's interesting. Burger buns. Various meats. Anything interesting down here, Claire? Yeah. Well, we haven't looked at the Greg's bit. W7, chicken portions. Living well. Here's the Greg's section, look. Oh, nacho chili cheese bake. New product alert. What'd you get in there then? Nacho cheese. 
golden puff pastry filled with sweet potato, roasted vegetables, mixed beans, quinoa and jalapenos in a Mexican style cheese flavoured sauce topped with cheese and nacho crumb. Sounds pretty good. Vegan? Steak and cheese rolls. Or vegetarian? Steak and cheese rolls, exclusive to Iceland. Ooh, corned beef, oh, corned beef cake. Oh, that sounds desperate, doesn't it, Claire? No, I do not like the sound of that. Tucked away on the top shelf is a nice little product there, a nice little vanilla chubba chub hand sanitizer. I'm gonna give that a smell. Smells pretty decent. So we're now out of the range, it's pitch black. Clocks actually go forward today, so it's even later. Uh, it's about, what, 12 a.m.? <coughs> Um, yeah, we're now going to go in M&S Food Hall, but I'm not going to take you with us. Um, I want to get some, they've got Mother's Day profiteroles, I'd like to get them. I sort of am craving, as well as a craving a chocolate loaf, chocolate chip loaf. I'm also craving a cream cake, like a eclair or, or profiteroles, so... Huh? Claire saying I already have a Claire. Correct. Um, it's not filled with cream though. <laughs> I'm not... No, I'm not touching that one. Uh, thank you very much for joining us. Check us out on Instagram at Brockgram and we'll see you next time. Cheers.